Mike, you probably don't know it, but council cleanups are an insane place to find all sorts of things that you can use in your own home. Like this cardboard box. Can you believe that somebody actually left this out? It looks brand new. And that can only mean that inside this house is a new widescreen TV. By keeping your eyes open, you can take the guesswork out of home invasion. And only hit on houses you know have something to offer. It's like I always say, a rich person's trash is a poor person's treasure map. If you're like me and you like to bend society's fascist rules, then chances are you're going to get caught out every once in a while. So today I'm going to give you some legal advice. Tell you what to do if you ever have to go to court. You shouldn't be afraid of the legal system. Remember, you are innocent until proven guilty. And even then, there are lots of loopholes to let you get away with it. For example, there are these things called legal precedents. Precedents are great. Basically, if someone has a really good excuse and gets away with it, anybody coming in after that can point at their example and say, you should let me off for the same reason. The precedent I'm going to use in today's trial is the stolen generation. Miss Penny. You are charged with stealing one broad screen digital television. How do you plead? Not guilty, Your Honour. What do you have to say in your defence? I cite the precedent of the stolen generation, Your Honour. You see, I did not steal that television. I took it into care. The owners of the television did nothing active to prevent me from removing their television which I took as tacit acceptance that they were unable to look after the television properly themselves. Whereas I assure your honour, the television enjoyed a good home with me. Free as a bird. And I got to keep the telly. You see, there's no need to be scared of the legal system. There's always an excuse. And any excuse that's good enough for the federal government is good enough for me.